This is a video about a trail that is close by to where I live. It's a beautiful place to go take a nice day hike. This particular day hike is called Bridal Wreath Falls. The hike itself is about six miles, but I went further than that because there's other loop trails all over that area. There's trails everywhere. There's miles and miles and miles of trails. If you haven't seen a saguaro cactus before, it is a virtual saguaro garden and you get to see all the different variations of them. But let's, let's just get into it and then I'll do my review of the shoes at the end of the hike and see how I feel. And we'll meet you right back here to see how the shoes performed.
the hike up halfway down and uh, this is the the pinnacle of the hike is this trickle of a waterfall uh, behind me and uh, the shoes feel great my feet feel great I don't feel like I've been walking for miles the rest of the trail is back down the same way we came uh, with the same vistas uh, so I'm not gonna post that but I will talk about the performance of the shoes by the end of the day and how my feet feel so so as you can tell these bad boys are nice and dusty and dirty I wore them out into the desert here and they were super comfortable I didn't feel hot in my feet I didn't feel sweaty at all I felt comfortable the whole time and there was nothing going on with my feet sometimes I get a little bit of, of heel soreness but I didn't get any heel soreness with these shoes I think the most important part is that they felt good at the end of the day and you don't really notice them bothering your feet at all if you've got uh, wider feet or need additional good cushioning this is a good shoe I'm confident now that I'll be able to hike a nice long distance with these while backpacking in the outdoors the next time we do another section of the Arizona Trail where we camp overnight these shoes I know are gonna be there on my feet only time will tell but still for me I still give two thumbs up on these bad boys check out the link below if you are interested straight up to the Keen site and then also Amazon for a similar pair to a similar Keen pre Bellows Flex. I will say the flexation during the hiking with these shoes I didn't really notice a difference but maybe I really wasn't paying much attention before. Shoes a lot of the time flex pretty well however if this particular design can make it so that this shoe lasts a longer time being able to absorb the shock of the back and forth back and forth then it's well worth it I would say and the best judge of how well they fit your feet and how suited the shoes are to you is if you've gone for a really long hike and your feet really don't bother you that much I've had shoes where parts of my feet start to go numb or where I start getting blisters and with these shoes I've not gotten any soreness I've not gotten any blisters this overall for me is a quality product I didn't slip and fall when I encountered a rattlesnake and I kept moving on by and I was able to turn and I had secure footing. You guys have a great day.